Today I fucked up by hooking up in a public park. So obligatory this wasn't today but months ago. Anyway, at one point my BF and I being the horny young adults we are, hooked up in my car in a public park. It was after dark, and afterward, we were just lying there half naked talking, when this unmarked white pickup pulled up into the parking lot. Someone in the bed of the truck started shining this really bright flashlight around. No idea what they were doing or looking for, but naturally we ducked down and his hoping they'd leave, they didn't. So I threw my shirt on and popped up so I could get the hell out of there when the flashlight snapped onto me, and at that moment I had a whole new understanding of the phrase deer in the headlights. Despite my panic, I pulled out of the park parking lot as calmly as possible and drove away. They followed us for a long time and I was panicking so bad, my boyfriend took the wheel and we switched spots while driving cause I didn't want to stop while we were being followed. They eventually stopped and I haven't been back to that park since. Too long didn't read, I hooked up in a park after dark, dude with a flashlight showed up and scared us out of the park then followed us. The Zodiac Killer would have loved you guys, smiley cat face. This sounds like the beginning of a horror movie. While there was a slight FU on your part, the bigger FU was from that guy slash guys, cops, be careful out there. You should never turn the tables on him. Whipped out your flashlights and follow him naked. Did you die? I think she did, but don't worry she's fine now. Today I fucked up by whittling on my toothbrush. Happened two days ago. Like most people the missus and I have a nightly routine involving peeing, brushing teeth etc. I'm a generally restless person and always believe there's ways of optimizing life. I find teeth brushing fairly boring and am usually researching something or organizing things while I brush my teeth. Two days ago I was intending to pee while brushing my teeth. My other half was also brushing at the bathroom sink which I believe actually indirectly contributed my faux pas. My pre-bed pee wasn't really coming so I continued to brush over the toilet, knob in hand waiting patient. As I finish brushing, the pee decides to stream out. Thinking about the next thing I need to do, rinse my toothbrush, I look over to the sink and see the tap now running that the missus had just turned on. My brain linked the running water with the need to clean the toothbrush and I look down to the brush I'm now holding near my pee stream and wash it. It took a split second to realize that was the wrong water stream and I'm now pissing on my toothbrush. I make a bit of a strange noise in surprise and my other half turns to see the most surreal sight of the day. Suffice to say it's time for a new one. Too long didn't read, did a brain fart and did a we on my toothbrush. I laughed, thank you for sharing your glorious brain fart. Time for a new toothbrush. Human brain is the weirdest fucking thing I STG. Lol this made my night thank you. I'll admit I did not see this coming. I honestly thought you misspelled whittling in your title. RIP toothbrush. Also brain farts are hilarious. The one that's most common for me is that I end up bringing dishes to the bathroom. I'll open the door, walk in with the dishes before I realize wait, wrong room, wrong sink and go to the kitchen. Thanks for sharing, I laughed because I have these moments too. Today I fucked up by blowing up a fully painted Warhammer army. Late last night I was playing games on my computer when I moved a small space heater closer to warm up my feet. A few minutes later there was a loud explosion to my left that felt like a bomb had gone off in my room. Unfortunately, a cardboard box containing a fully painted, 1750 point Necron army was right next to the blast. The box flew a good 3 feet and the contents were sent literally all across the room. After about 10 minutes vainly searching for pieces I finally realized, or maybe finally accepted that the vast majority of the models were beyond repair. That's around when I figured out what had gone off like a small bomb in my room. I had left a can of compressed air to the side of my desk and forgotten about it. The heater must have been enough to set it off. I'm still kind of processing the whole thing as it was hundreds of dollars and dozens of hours of work just completely obliterated. On the plus side I wasn't injured, though the whole thing left a literal bitter taste in my mouth from the anti-huffing agent in the air. Too long didn't read, forgot I had a can of compressed air under my desk and accidentally blew it up with a space heater, destroying a fully painted Warhammer army in the process. 
Oh God I'm feel so sorry for you. Must be hard for that to happen. Sometimes it can be like losing your children that you worked so hard on. Oof my dude I am so sorry. That is awful D. That really sucks. Maybe use them as wounded veterans? Rebuild the little pieces into some new horrific amalgam. This hurts. Try reanimation protocol it helped when my necrons got blown up.